Ain't no way I can scramble a nigga egg without my toes. My jeans too skinny, got a bad bitch with me. Nickel, Nicky, and her purse. Uh, let me get this out the way right now. Y'all straight free serve. Free the ways. Free the ways. That pretty school? Mm-hmm. Them niggas on them niggas on the news. Fox Five put the nigga Calico picture up. That was real ghetto. What? That's that was crazy, crazy, bro. That was real ghetto. That's real fucking ghetto. crazy. Like I, I shame on Lisa Evers because she do a little segment called Street Soldiers on the news and she always come on the radio. The you know better, bitch. Yeah, like, Lisa, you supposed to know better than that shit. If I'm not mistaken, I thought I seen Surf on an on a episode of Street Soldiers. I could be wrong. Yeah, no, before, I that. Like that might, yeah, that's fucked up. You know how, it's probably someone from her newsroom fucked that up, man. Yeah. Because I doubt she handpicked the picture. There's probably someone on her editing team that dropped that. Did she look at the picture, though? Like, did you even yeah. look? That's what I'm saying. Like, right, did you do a run-through before? Did you just get up there and they be like, hey, insert picture of Surf now, and they pulled up the wrong one? You know what I'm saying? Right. That's that's how I would I'd imagine it goes. I have no idea, but that's how I'd imagine it went. At least for the sake of her not being a complete dipshit. <laughs> that's that's why. That's <laughs> just why. Like, the fuck? A complete Cal goes dipshit. another one of the biggest battle rappers, too. It's not like y'all just found... You know what I'm saying? That's just what... But, but Fox you know 5 always been on some wax shit. motherfuckers' names and shit, and other pictures come up associated with us because we all tagged in battle rap stuff, so I don't know if right. I'm one of those things or what. <laughs> But I still feel, I've always felt like Fox 5 just been trash for a while. Like, they even try to speak slang in some of these shows, but you can't. <laughs> we gotta do all that. Like, don't speak slang in the show, please. Like, so crazy. Some, listen, some of the places from out of state, like, y'all news people are chopped and they look, they look dusty. It's like, why do y'all let them get on a TV like that? I don't, New York, I can't say that for them because I don't be seeing, too, I don't remember seeing anything looking crazy. But um, some of the motherfucking news people I've seen around the country on my stays, man, they be looking crazy. Some of y'all newscasters be looking crazy. Y'all need to write to the network and complain, and they'll make them change it. Y'all didn't know. They'll make them change that shit. Forty. That's how. They, that's how the people look. Nah, I got a picture of a meteorologist. A meteorologist in a freaking dress. Listen, Boston, right? they used to complain about Anquanette Jameson, right? One of the only black bitches on the morning news, man. And sis was a regular looking chick. She was straight, but they kept talking about her wig was too, her hair was too stiff. But it, it was a whole big thing or whatever. They was complaining about her hair was too stiff. They tried to change her, her hair and stuff. But then it came out like the, the fucking network. Um, they had to come get fucking, I guess, more stylists that could do her hair, ethnic hair. You get what I'm saying? Because they're fucking, she got a fucking a roller set, and they fucking teasing that shit like she's a fucking a rich white lady, nigga. Spray her shit all fucking stiff. She looked crazy all the time. And it's not like she didn't, like, have no hair or nothing like that. Or was it bad weave? It was like, you could tell they didn't know what the fuck they was doing her hair. But people kept writing in and complaining. Black people was writing in and complaining, y'all. They had to switch that shit the fuck up. They need better stylists. That's what it sounds like to me. Huh? No, that's what it was. No, but that's what it ultimately ended up um, having that whole conversation about. I guess they didn't have the proper stylist there for her. Right. Like, I be seeing that shit, too, on TikTok now, too. Like, a lot of models and stuff like that. They're on these runway shows and stuff. They don't got people there to do proper makeup for melanated women. They don't know how to work with these hair textures. Y'all want them to do yeah. stage hairstyles. And y'all spraying all kind of product that doesn't go and people of colors here, like all that kind of shit. So that's a big thing. Not having um, professionals that are able to work with different types of people. So mm -hmm. this wig is my own wig's a little dry. I'm talking about Antoinette's child. Bang, 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 bang.